This is the Ansel BD200 Bluetooth OBD2 scanner. Let's take it out of the box. In the box is a user manual which basically explains how to connect it up to your phone or your tablet. And here is the device itself. This plugs into the OBD2 port on your vehicle and it has a blue light on it there. Um, really it doesn't do any good here without the car so we're going to bring this out to the car in a moment. The scan tool will do all of your standard scan tool functions. It can read the check engine light or the malfunction indicator light status. If there are any codes stored, it can pull those for you and tell you what they are. And you can erase those codes. You can check the monitoring systems and uh, various other engine parameters, get live stream data, all the type thing that you would expect from a good OBD2 scan tool. So let's go ahead and take this out to the car and we'll give it a test. So under the dash in your vehicle, you'll find the port and then you will go ahead and plug the scan tool in, just like that. Once in the app, you're going to hit the connect button there, and we'll hit scan and pair. It'll bring you to the Bluetooth settings on your device, there it is, and we'll connect up like you would any other Bluetooth device. Okay, once you get that paired up, you're going to go ahead and tap on that device, and it says communicating with vehicle, please wait. And now I'm going to switch over to a screen recording of the tablet. Now I'm just going to give you a brief overview of some of the screens that you will see within the Ansel app. It'll show you all kinds of different information in there. So let's go right into it. This is the main screen that you will see here and you can scroll through all of the different options. If we go into the dashboard, you can see the RPM is zero, but if I start the engine up, so you can see how that all uh, updated in real time. Here is the vehicle speed sensor at the top. At the bottom is the engine coolant temperature, and the engine was just started, so you can see that starting to climb here, and we'll just give that a moment to get up to uh, where it does. And over here, there's a bunch more inf information about the mass airflow sensor, throttle position, spark advance, etc. In here you can see the fault codes. This car does not have any fault codes. And here is the I am readiness monitor page. It can show you all of the monitoring systems to ensure that your vehicle is ready for inspection. Over here it shows you the data from the O2 sensors in the vehicle. And here is an onboard monitoring test. You can see there is a lot of information here. This is something that generally a mechanic would look at to get the data that he needs. Over here is a performance test. I'm not going for a drive here, so it just sits there. But you can see if I rev it up, it will show that right there. And now we're taking a look at the computer that runs the transmission in the vehicle. When you hit the play button at the top, as I did, it's now going to run through and read all of the data from that computer and give you further information. And it also does an EVAP monitor test, but that's not supported on my vehicle. So once again, this was the Ansel BD200 Bluetooth OBD2 scan tool. If you'd like to purchase this item, I'll leave a link in the video description where you can find it available for sale on Amazon. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like, 
make sure you click subscribe and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.